welcome back everyone, General Tony here, coming back with a brand new COC episode, and finally, Supercell have just tweeted that we are going to be receiving the update changes, the sneak peeks, all the balance changes from tomorrow. So if you want to know what's coming into the game inside of the Christmas update, guys, make sure you subscribe to this channel right now. I will keep you all up to date and provide you with every last little detail you need to know. So one final announcement just before we do get ourselves into the episode, and this is going to be one of the last times I ever say this on the channel. If you want the chance to enter the 1 million subscriber giveaway, this is the final chance, guys. The giveaway ends in three days' time. We are giving away a brand new PlayStation 4 and an Xbox One, guys, just before Christmas. If you want the chance to win one of those two prizes, all you need to do is leave a like right now on this episode to enter. Literally, just go down below, guys, slap a like on the video, Make sure you subscribe to this channel. Only subscribers will have the chance to win those prizes, guys. So if you're not subbed to the channel, make sure you drop a sub. There is a link down below in the description box. Click the link, click enter, and you will be entered into the giveaway, guys. So drop a like, sub to the channel, and enter the link down below. As ever, I'm going to let you know who the winners are in literally three days' time live on camera. So if you haven't seen my face before, Stay tuned, I will also be doing a face cam. So what we're going to do in this episode right now, this is going to be pretty damn insane and uh, quite crazy, to be honest with you. So basically, we are about to attack this base using 120 wall breakers and check out the size of the wall going directly through the center of the base. So what I want every single one of you dudes to do, go down below in that comment section and let me know how many percentage points do you think the wall breakers are going to get. So obviously... We got 120 wall breakers, we are going to use the heroes, we are also going to use the rage bells. But I want you guys to tell me down below, how much percent will we get on this base? Go down below, take your guess guys, I'm going to give you 5 seconds. So hopefully you've taken your guess down below in that comment section. Uh, you know what, whoever gets the closest guess will win 250 gems. 250 gems, so go down below, take your guess guys, here we go. 120 wall breakers. We're just going to spawn them all in together. Let's see what happens. Let's see if we can four finger them. Four finger the wall breakers. And there they go. Whoa. Check it out, guys. Okay. Here we go. Rage Bell, Rage Bell, Grand Warden. We're going to pop the Grand Warden's ability to make those, Im uh, those wall breakers immortal. Wow. Wow. They've destroyed that great wall. They've literally tormented it. Oh, my God. They've gone all the way straight to the back, guys. Check it out. So we've dropped down another Rage Bell. And another Rage Bell. So many Rage Bells. Have they made it? They pretty much made it. Whoa. Check out the amount of destruction they've done inside of that base, guys. So we're going to drop the uh, the king and the queen just over here to see if we can tear down the, uh, the rest of the base. Let's see how much damage we can do. So, so far, we are up to 4%, guys. Remember, I told you to take your guess in that comment section. How much percentage points will the wall breakers do? There goes the King's Ability. We're already up to 6%, guys. Can we close in on that one star? I kind of doubt it, but you never know. You really never know. So the uh, the Queen's Ability is going to have to get used shortly. Here we go. Going to pop the Queen's Ability up to 16% so far. I do not know how the Barbarian King is still alive. I mean, it literally surprises me. But there, the Queen is targeted. That level 1 Barbarian King. Is she going to take it out? Oh, that was close. Can she take out the Grand Warden? Nope. And the Barbarians down as well. So there we go, guys. A total of 20% damage. Um, I don't know if that was good or bad. So we're going to try this just one last time. Then we're going to delete half the wall breakers and bring half a different army. So we're going to try it one last time. I want to see if I can get five fingers down on the screen, guys. So let's see. Uh, we've got, we got one, two, three, four, five fingers down on the screen. I'm hoping that's five fingers. Is that every single one of them down? Yes, it is. Here we go, Rage Spell, Rage Spell, Rage Spell, another Rage Spell, Grand Warden, Grand Warden's ability has just been used as well. Check it out! That is insane, guys, and we've already dropped down all four of the Rage Spells. Those Wall Breakers are tearing those walls into pieces. There is no way around it. Wow. We have destroyed it. We have destroyed this base. There goes the King, there goes the Queen, just under the Rage Spell, but they have faded, guys. The Grand Warden's dead. Let's see if we can beat 16%. I think we will because the king and the uh, the actual archer queen have gone to the other side of the base. And the queen is just out of range of the expo. That was so close. So we're just going to go ahead and poison the heroes. Although I think they're going to move out the poison zone. Are they going to? No. No. The queen stays in. I didn't realize the queen stays in the poison zone. So where is our archer queen, guys? Our queen is cleaning up these buildings. The barbarian king's actually getting targeted. 
by the Eagle Artillery. I did not even know that. So, oh, we've already beat it, guys. We're already up to 32%. You know what? We could actually possibly get a one star here. Let's see if we can one star the base using all wall breakers. That would be cool. So we still got the King's ability. I think he can survive maybe one more Eagle Artillery. And then after that, we're going to have to, I think, probably use his ability. So here we go, guys. Queen's ability is going to get used. King's ability is going to get used. We need a one star straight into a giant big bomb. That is so unfortunate, guys. Here we go. 44%. Can the Queen take out the Inferno Tower? She's done it. Can she take out the Archer Tower? Yes, but 45%. And it doesn't look like we're going to be getting a one star, unfortunately. So it ends at 45%. So let's go ahead, guys, and delete. Let's delete 60. So we're going to bring 60 wall breakers. And then we're going to fill the rest of the spaces with... Should we fill them with barbarians? That that, that would be pretty cool, guys. Let's, let's do it. Here we go. Where are they? Barbarians. So we can fit 120 barbarians. This is going to be pretty fun. There we go. 120 barbarians. Let's send another challenge from baby Tony and uh, see what they can do this time. So let's attack the base guys. So we got 120 barbarians, 60 wall brokers, and of course the other uh, heroes. And I'm, I'm guessing it's going to be pretty funny. So there you go the wall breakers. There go the barbarians just behind guys. Can we drop them all in before the wall breakers reach the wall? Yes, we can. Grand Warden's ability has just been used in time. That was so close. There go the heroes as well. The Barbarians are actually all stuck on the other buildings. I completely forgot about that, so that's a little bit unfortunate. Don't worry, though. We are going to try this again. This time, though, we're going to take out those buildings before the uh, the actual wall breakers destroy the walls. So we're going we're gonna to go in for one final attack. So obviously, guys, once the update information does start to come out tomorrow and over the next couple of weeks, then we are over the next week or so, or sorry, we are going to start to pump out some more videos on the channel. So for those of you that are new around here, we are literally the most active Clash of Clans channel in the world, I believe. We usually post two episodes every single day. However, sometimes if I'm busy, like today, then we may only post one. I'm not sure if there will be a second episode later on today, guys, because I am going ice skating. And uh, I don't know what time I'm going to be back, but hopefully there will be a second episode coming out. So we're going to pop the Queen's ability. We've actually got 77%, which is quite high. So uh, that, that's a nice surprise. We've got the Barbarians down. It doesn't look like we're going to be two-starring, guys. You know what? Let's just end that there. Let's try it one final time, except this time we're going to start a, a different kind of strategy. So if we go in for the final attack, check this out. What we're going to do... We're actually going to drop the Barbarians in first to take out those buildings, guys. And then hopefully the rest of them will actually go around and, uh, you know, do some great damage. So here we go. Buildings have pretty much been taken out. There goes King, Queen, Grand Warden. We're going we're gonna to hold the Grand Warden for a second. We're going to drop the, uh, the Wall Breakers in now, guys. Here we go. How many are down? There we go. All the Wall Breakers are down. There's the Grand Warden. Rage, Rage, Rage. This is going to be cool. There goes the Grand Warden's ability. Unfortunately, some of the wall breakers did get destroyed. Spring traps going off, but we got so many holes inside of the base. There goes the final rage spell. Can we three star this base, guys? It is all about the three star. Let's see what happens. The first Inferno Tower, in fact, the whole right hand side of the base has been demolished. But if you look over on the left hand side, it's kind of like a little stronghold. And I'm not sure if we're going to be able to beat it, but it's always going to be worth a chance. So the, uh, the Barbarian King is in the center there. He's actually taking on the enemy Barbarian King. Gonna have to pop the King's Ability because Eagle Artillery is coming, guys. Spawned up loads of Barbarians. Takes out the Archer Queen. But unfortunately, my Barbarian King has gone down. We still have our oh, level 40 Archer Queen and her ability. Some backup Barbarians. And of course, the Grand Warden. But he's pretty much dying as well. So this has definitely been a very awesome episode. If you've made it all the way to the end, guys, leave a like. Subscribe to the channel. As I said, if you want to stay up to date with all the information that's going to be coming out. I cannot wait to see what Supercell has in store for us. Obviously, there have been some, uh, some massive rumors going around. And the update hype is definitely getting bigger. So we just lost the Archer Queen. I'm actually surprised. We didn't even three-star the base. That's quite surprising. So, uh, yeah, we actually lost there. So the Grand Warden is going to take out the Eagle Artillery. We're going to end it there, guys. There's no point carrying that on. So what we're going to do for the rest of the day, we are currently inside of the Baby Tony Clan, but I'm actually going to leave that. I don't know if I should open this. I don't know whether I'll open this, guys. Let me know. Do you want me to open the Baby Tony Can? Baby Tony Can? Sorry, the Baby Tony Clan. Let me know down below. So we are going to trophy push now, but I do have to delete these... Uh, the wall breakers and the barbarians obviously we cannot be taking them into the legends league for those of you that are actually wondering 
I was using air attacks, guys, and then I was using ground attacks, but I can't quite make my mind up as to which attack is actually best, so I don't really know what to use. I think I'm going to stay with, uh, you know, the uh, the strategy that, that's been working best for me. So we're going to go to Bruce spells. We don't actually have any spells inside of our army. Yes, we do. Four rage spells. So we're going to, uh, sorry, cancel that. We're going to bring ourselves a jump spell and we're going to train ourselves a, a bowler army. So this is the army I might actually use. 20 bowlers. I'm going to go a giant uh, golem, sorry. We're going to go four giants, three healers, some uh, some wizards. And a couple of wall breakers. Let's drop out two of those bowlers. Let's go for. We need six wall breakers. Drop out another two bowlers. And then, sorry, drop out one more. 15 bowlers. And we'll bring ourselves some extra Harry Potters. So there we go. That is the entire army. Golems, healers, Harry Potters looking pretty damn sweet. So I am going to end the episode here, guys. I will see you shortly. Peace out.